And we're back in the game with some more Call of Warhammer, beginning of the end times, a mod for Medieval 2, Total War. Sigma is a lie. Hmm, I think that might be a slightly biased opinion from this chap known as Archaean, the have chosen. Could well be. Now we are playing as Corn. Uh, if you watched this far, you already know that we are playing as Corn. We've got an army here. I think we had a battle over here against Ostland last time and we practically wiped them out. Right. Oh yeah. I think I'm going to break the siege here. Uh, we've discovered that once we attack uh, Sal Carlton, they basically spawn in most of stack, something like 75 to 80% of a full stack. And I believe when we besieged it, it only had like four units in it. Um, so yeah, we're going to leave that alone. Now I don't know if Norden is going to do that. Verlangen, I don't think, did it. So we're probably going to break the siege there. But it's going to allow that full stack to come out and mess with us. What we might do is ignore these settlements up here. And just push on down here. Um, because last time... Chaos Undivided went after them as well, and there is the Chaos, or there are the Chaos Dwarves over here. We should get a spy out there, I think. We've got a spy somewhere down here. In fact, how many spies do we have? Probably get another one, I think. Alright, we've got one at Wolfenburg, that's fine. One breeder, or breeder. Right, one at Norden, so we only have four. We've got two diplomats. Okay, we'll try to get another trade agreement going there. We only have two merchants. I think we'll start getting some more merchants though. Right, we did uh, eventually get peace treaty with Zinch, didn't we? Alright, what we're going to do, just try and get some map info with them. So we've got the peace treaty with Zinch. Uh, we don't make much from trade. I mean, our taxes are almost equal to trade, and for being 130 turns in, that's very unusual. Usually, traders outstrip taxes. Normally, taxes stay out out as your biggest source of income, and then it goes to trade, and then for the dwarves, it's mining with farming last. But for most other factions, it's farming, then mining. But yeah, our trade barely outstrips. I mean, literally, something like 800. Um, our taxes, how much are we getting from merchants? Yeah, very little. I mean, this one's getting 47. You can get 82 there. So we might as well move them. Uh, we get 48 there. That one's at 105. All right, let's bring him over. I'm sure we can get another merchant up there, can't we? Man of War, uh, there's a merchant. There are a lot of trade resources up here. We might as well make use of it. Uh, we've got a Ostland merchant up there. wonder if we can get an assassin anywhere. Let's hope we can. I'm sure we had an assassin before, didn't we? Priest, merchant, what do we have to do to get an assassin? There's a spy, there's a diplomat, priest, merchant, yeah. What's in here that could give us a an assassin if we can get them? What building was that? Sacrificial altar, that's the spy, so sacrificial altar. There. No, we can only get a spy out of that one. What about Chieftain's Halls? No, diplomat. Chaos Temple, Priest, no Assassin. Alright, I don't think we can get Assassins. There's a Merchant. Chaos. Nope, none from there. None from there. Uh, none from there. Unlikely to get it from the Smith. Kennel, nope. Here, Wolves and Dogs are bred to war. 
fishers. Fisheries? Nope. Weaponsmith? No. I'm thinking maybe we can't get an assassin. Yeah, some mods take out certain agents. Uh, actually, that's a large shout, so that's likely to have an assassin if we can get him. Right, it doesn't look like we can get an assassin. Right, I didn't even turn on the blaster timer. I'm getting very forgetful in my old age. Alright, you're coming over there. Alright, now I think we're rebuilding a couple of armies, aren't we? Ooh, we don't really want to fight this one because they are very tough. Yeah, basically, two, 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 well, four actually. Those are the ones we couldn't kill off last time. Uh, so, yeah, he had literally four units in there. Uh, no cavalry apart from there. Is this army better than what we had last time though? Uh, I think we had. We definitely had a monstrous unit, trolls, and I think dragon ogres as well. I think we probably just have more numbers. You know what? Let's have another crack at it. If we win, we're going to claim the settlement. And if we had uh, retreated, they would have sallied out with that whole stack, so they would have caused us trouble in, no matter what. So we've basically got to get rid of some of their numbers right now. Alright, get rid of that, rush forward. Last time, it was their general who came out directly, wasn't it? All by his lonesome. And so I say, let's go and try to get to him. Because he's at the front of the line again. I can see him. There he is. And if we could kill him, that would be very, very good. Right, he's just activated that tower. Alright, get in there. Get him with the pointy sticks. We got him down to one man last time, obviously. It was the... Uh, Count Valmer. Alright, we killed two of them already. Alright, get over there. Because you're going to have to get in on his flank. Yep, we're actually killing them fairly easily. Although we are obviously taking a lot of casualties. Right, get in on those units. Fire back there. And hope you don't cause too much friendly fire. We lost 4%, he's lost 3. Right, and they're doing the same thing as last time. Sending out a lot of units over on this flank. So, we're going to have to counter them. That's our cavalry force. Three, because our general is infantry. He's down to 26. Alright, we're going to send some stronger units over there. Hold them back. Alright, start shooting them. You should have been running. Alright, that's another spear unit. Oh, he's down to 18 already. Get over there. Slow those units down. Alright, you come in keep up the morale. Right. Take out the artillery. There should be two units of those. Might just see one. Alright, so there's those black guards. Uh, we've lost a unit, unfortunately. 
hold your ground. I mean, they might rally. Oh, we've killed off a lot more than uh, we've lost, haven't we? Doesn't look like any more are going to come out from that side. Uh, there goes yet another unit. Right, hold your ground. You are going to try and stop them. Right, we've pretty much killed off most of those units that came around on the flank. Right, you didn't seem to have got a good charge in on them. Right, pull back. Same with you. Right. Uh, well, we got some of them. They're going down quite quickly, considering. Right, I'm going to manually target them because that's another full unit of black guard up by the wall. Right, is anyone coming out here? Nope. We've got 61% of them. Their leader's got to be close to going down. Go on, clear out those units. I think that was one of the ones who broke, and that was a unit who broke, but they rallied. Right, get you over there on that flank. Yep, taking out most of those. Pull back. We've still got a lot of heavy units. Don't think you can. You're in a position to get a good charge in on anyone at the moment. Their leader is down once again to one man. All right. Uh, we've used up some ammunition on some of the archers. Some of them still have quite a few missiles to use. Let's see if we can fire over at them. Might not do too much damage to them. But you never know. Alright, pushing over here. At least my general's got a lot of men still left. We've definitely got the numbers. like to get a charge in over here. Maybe we can get in on them. There's another unit that we can throw into the meat grinder. And we've still got several heavy units. They're more than a match for the Ostlanders. It does look like we're managing to hit some of those. Right, you got a charge in, didn't you? Keep pushing in. Keep up the morale, General. I mean, I am tempted to fire into this mass, but well, we killed a fair number of the uh, crossbows. They had two units, so I don't know where the other one is. Maybe uh, they were outside the gates. Took a lot of casualties. Alright, we lost 89%. Right, have another crack at them. Oh. 
There he is, Count Valmare. Somebody kill that man for me. He's got to go down fairly soon. Right, you're out of ammunition as well. He just will not die. He must have a lot of hit points. Right, those are the ones that are trying to get up on the wall. We must have a ma enough mass to push through by now. Because the gates are still open. Come on, there's basically no one there. Come on, push through. Right, they're going to have to come back off the wall. Their leader is still outside somewhere. Probably holding the gate all by him's lonesome. Right, if they want to stay on the wall, that's fine. Because they're not going to help out much there. Should be able to just push them out of the way. Now, cavalry, I want you over there. I want somebody to cap the town centre. Oh, is he down? He's down. Alright. See so if we can get somebody up there. Somebody up there. Alright. Now that's the black guard. We're going to need stronger units to deal with them. All of you archers run for the town centre. Ooh. We don't need to continue. That was a very good victory, unlike the last time. Last time the battle came down to like 99% enemy losses and 98% my loss. Alright, uh, we're going to have to kill a lot of people. That was a good victory. I really was tempted to withdraw though. Right, so that has obviously weakened Ostland to a degree. We need to get more armies down there. Sound like we got a mission. Um, What did we get for that mission? There's a... Oh, oh that's always loud. Sorry about that. Alright. Get those generals down. And we were building up a lot of forces there because we got more troublemakers up there. Actually, that's an extra unit. Right, we'll send somebody up there to deal with them. Vampire Counts don't like us for some reason. Night Goblins and Orcs don't like us. Mission success. We got four units of blood ladders. That's right there. Wow. How much do they cost? 420 each, but they are very good. We need to get them into battle ASAP. Right. Now we also have to get rid of those troublemakers as well. I think, I think all of those are at full strength. Alright. Now we've got another agent, didn't we? 
All right, we've got rebels up here. There's a merchant that's worth eight. For you're an absolutely terrible merchant. <laughs> really, he is really bad. Can't even see what that's going to be worth. Oh my god, he is literally one of the worst agents I have ever seen. I mean, 13 is the best he could do. 4, 13, 8, 9, oh my god, 13 is the best he could do. I'm going to send him after him. He needs to be killed off by somebody. What about this one? 26, 18, Nine. He's not much better, is he? I mean, 26, and he cost, what, 550 to get him. Alright, where was that spy? Did I actually recruit another one? And we've got merchant. We've got one, two merchants, so I didn't get another spy. No, but... We've got the diplomat over there. Just try to get some map info. Alright. Yep. Come on over there. I think we'll put in a watchtower. Alright. He does indeed. Good old corn. Right, you're at full strength. Indeed. Is that a general? It is a general. Right, bodyguard, 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 Albert. Right, what else is available? Uh, did we have another general building up here? We have that one under siege. Oh yeah, Kislev was rioting, wasn't it? Grab those. Unless there's anyone from there to put in. No. Yeah. I think we got another temple in there, didn't we? To boost the... Chaos conversion. Sacrificial altar. Oh, it does allow sacrifices to be construct, uh, done. 46. Yep, we're going to pay for that. That's well worth paying for. Here's an extra unit. Right, grab those. We've got four generals coming down, I think. There's some units who have been retrained. Alright, get those retrained. What can we do at Sal Carlton and Philangan? We need to get some more units in. Ah, oh, we can get a priest, that will help. Alright, 42. Now, uh, more units. <laughs> nope. That one. Doesn't help out much, but it does allow us to get the better infantry later on. That will allow us to get all of the Eastman units. Actually, that's only going to give us one the festivals, isn't it? Well, I think I have to do that one. I'm going to take out that general. Actually, I'm going to leave him out. He can go and Start forming up a new army somewhere. You do that, mate. You do that. Right, so they got a blue face. You probably need to destroy a lot of buildings. So we get some money back. Resistance is never futile. So we got those two done. 
we're going to have to get the herdstone as, again, as quickly as possible. We can drop the taxes. He's not a good governor. He's got a penalty there. And there's a lot of religious unrest. So let's pop him out. Yeah, again, it's better off out. What kind of a talisman did he have? Chaos Rune Shield. Armor of Tortured Souls. So we need that for the units and free upkeep. Right. And you need to start coming and building a new army. Alright, some of those need retraining, so we'll probably change out him, that whole army, so you stay there and get those units, get that one, forward, right, more units coming from there, more from Kislev, and another army building up. Actually, I'm going to start him moving because that's going to fall in two turns. And we got those four generals. Let's come on down. So that's good. Alright. Where can I get a spy from? Merchant. What about Prague? Uh, priest. Merchant. Right, we're gonna. They can't quite reach, but we're gonna kill him off. Why? Why can't they? Who did I put in there? Well, that's odd. Why can't we? Why can't we hit him like that? Well. That's a new general. Yeah, sorcerers, we can get them there and get them retrained. It cost 5,000 and take four turns. Um, they cost 4,500 and take four turns. What's your upkeep? 1,000 a turn. Oh, yours is 900. What about all of those minotaurs that I've been getting? How much do they cost? Per turn 800, but they have been the most effective monstrous units I've been getting. Right, I do want to get a spy. Where can I get a spy? Man of war, priest, diplomat. Nope, not from there. I was going to sally out with you. I don't know if you could win that one. Let's see. First, let's see what you're up against. Alright. Well, you didn't win. We'll have to send out somebody to help you. Right. Probably get another Man of the Hour event for that. Now there is one trade resource over here that I do want to get. I think that's Warpstone. That's very rare. There's only like three places I've seen it. I think we have the other Warpstone up there. And there's, I think, somewhere out here in the... Uh, oh, what is it? I forgot the name of the uh, area. It's not the Chaos Wastes. Uh, it's where the Chaos Dwarves come from, but it's not called Chaos Waste. Ah, I've forgotten it. Uh, but yeah, somewhere out here, there is another warp stone. There it is. So, I think that's gemstones there. I think it is. Right, that's where we're going to end at this one. So, that was a good victory at Sal Carlton. Um, now, if we attack them, they can only spawn. Let's see, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seventeen. They can only spawn three units, so they keep the uh, 
well, most of them at full strength. So they could only spawn three. We'll leave that one until later on because it's a good choke point to stop anyone from coming down. So I think we'll just defend there if we get attacked and try to take out Wolfenberg because then we can defend this river crossing, that one, and those two. And then we're kind of free to decide where we want to strike. <laughs> 